out with man and man and cussing out over this and that and talking over this and that when the real issue is we should all be taking our own shit our own self into account nobody needs to tell you about a future that's already present so the only thing that really matters right now after my sitting on my about so much thing and i overwork my brain is my health my mental stability and finding different income streams because i'll be damned if because of them prime minister and them government boy me i forgot to turn to some fuckery just to feed my family and to them it's fuckery but when you have to feed your family to you it's like yo it's the last ditch effort so these three things are the only things that are that matter that is important it's not no fucking fat body girl it's not no fucking fat matic it's not no partying you know it's like like being in country and coming back even closer to Kingston side right now is like a mind frame. Like they then place the you just have made three things. You just have try eat the right food to stay healthy. You really just have try keep your mind in check. The things you think, the things you want to accomplish, it all starts here. So you have a control here and keep it stable. And then you need money. Like if you go through life and acting like you don't need money, then something is wrong with you. It's the currency of the land. Everywhere you go, they use money. Whether it's digital or paper or mineral, which is like coin and bronze and whatever the fuck. So, I just look at life like this. Fuck everything else, bro. Yo, even me as a... Like, today me that for just wake up and be like... You know, that's why I haven't really released any music in a while. I'm going to release music, but... Is that really fucking important right now? Like, yes, we need music to survive. Do I need to remind you, though, that life is hard and everything? You should know that. Do I need to remind you we're in a pandemic? Do I need to remind you I need to burn somebody? Do I need to do some type of topic just to know? Then, therefore, I should be making music to try to just kind of help us. Help myself, help you. Is it me? So much reach a different brain. All of this, this Instagram shit, this Twitter shit, it's all irrelevant, bro. All this bickering and chatting and keeping up this game and who have the latest nights and who have the fucking air forces of the century and this ego thing that we are living off for. Like when you go home, what, what, what good is your ego? Yeah, yeah. When you're home and you know you're in a situation, you're in a global situation, and you know you're affected. Only three things it boils down to at the end of the day. Your mental health, your physical, your, your, your immune health, and your fucking money, your financial health. Like, that's all it boils down to, really and truly. Because everything is raising, you know, the prices, your bills, your rents, everything. So that's basically, you need finances to be able to at least stay alive or keep afloat in this, like, climate, economic climate. Then just to maneuver and see the different traps, distractions fucker you need your mind's eye to be open even if it's just to use it to create ways out of these situations even if it's to find ways to get out of the situation we're in right now you need your mind to be at its best you know you know i find myself not being able to read the physical books but i find it i can breeze off you know an audio book within two three four days because all i'm doing is listening that's what i'm good at i'm good at listening i'm listening to mixes right now for three four months every day trying to perfect the songs so i most can listen to an audiobook and it really helps my mind as a time of just being still and listening and keeping my mind's eye just open for things that these books might say that might jog me to do something you know what i mean you know going out and exercising and working out and jogging not for the cameras to see not for anybody to see but for you to feel good when you come in and that burst of energy in the morning you know what I mean? It's just, these are the things that are important. These are the things that are really important. It's not the fact that we don't get a chance to party anymore. It's not the fact that, you know, it's, it's just crazy. Like, you know, my priorities, everything is shifting. And I feel like yours should too. You can't come out of this situation and, like, you know, this man, our prime minister in Jamaica put the curfew at 7 p.m. You know what I mean? Damn, it's like, 
that's a little bit of hours to work with, you know what I mean? Especially for people that, as he claims, work in the night industry. So it forces you to have to think about different things. These, for lack of a better word, because I don't want them to censor my shit, like these injection boys, you know? They, they, it, it, everything is law, it's becoming law and becoming mandatory. And this life is pretty scary for you if you're somebody that is not too quick to run up in the arms of the system for them to help you, you know what I mean? It can be a bit tricky. So, I've just boiled it down to three things that I'm going to do every fucking day of my life. Whether or not there's a pandemic, I'm going to stay healthy as best as I can. My go make sure some of mine is as strong as it can be. Like, I know as much as I can and willing to learn what's on the way, you know what I mean? And, I'm going to try and find as much income streams within this music and outside of this music as I can. Because God bless the streams only give me. God bless the, the 30% engagement from Spotify. God bless the 6,000 new followers every, every platform every month. But we have to be diverse now. Everything has to diversify. Your money, you have to think about your money different now. You have to think about your friends different. You have to think about your family different. You have to think about yourself differently. It's just that time there. And this conversation is just a conversation I've been having with myself. You know what I mean? Even now doing music, I'm kind of glad the situation I'm getting in in regards to the people that are going to be around me and Ray. For the fact that they've put my mindset on a frame like, you know, even just working with certain people, the energy that, you know, their karma might bring to you, you know, like it is so deep. You know what I mean? On brand level and on an energy level, so... I'm just trying to say right now, there's nothing, nothing more important than your mental health, your physical, and, you know, your overall immune health, and your financial health. Like, nobody talks about that. Nobody wants to talk about the money. But financially, I have to talk to my landlord about my rent every month. He must raise free rent every year. JPS and them, it's going up. Gas is going up. Food, a loaf of bread is almost five hundred dollars, man. Like, I do a loaf of bread for almost five hundred dollars. For, for people in America, that's what, like, what two dollars something, three dollars something. In like, it's a lot. Like, you know what I mean? Just to so, if you're not focused on these three things right now, you're going to be set back in life. Man, tell you straight up, no joke, no debate, no. Like, these are the things that I'm literally thinking about every day. Like, and when I think about staying healthy, I get up and go do that jog. I get up and do that push out and that core workout. I, get, I go and get that Irish mash. I go and get this water, coconut water with lime. I go and sip this um, turmeric tea with ginger and garlic. You know what I mean? And sip some bell pepper with some, um, we call this now, we call them thing, uh, cayenne pepper and some apple cider thing and some, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, my friend. And them thing that would happen right now. So, if I were you, as much as, oh, I love parties and the night shows and the nightlife really is what fuels my industry, I would love if, even when the curfew or the times go back to what it's supposed to be, we can take a break from party into a second. You know what I mean? We can. Like, all my friends bridging them in a dance hall and everything, as much as, oh, it's cool, like, if nobody says to you guys to drink tea, you know not to drink no tea. You can't just wake up with NSC every morning, bro. I feel like that's like a flush for your pain. All of my brethren in my sofa, all of my sister in my sofa, and them turn to comedy or escapism or the bottle or weed just to escape these things. I get it, I understand, but right now, bro. Right now. Right now, my sister. Right now, my brother. Big man thing. Bigger than any fucking song we can ever make. Funa. You need to stay healthy as fuck. You need to stay alive. Boom, boom, like you need to think about your money. You need to think about how it work for you. Money is a groupie, you see me? It always a go to you, but quick for left to you, you see me? A who hot money go to you. Know? So you have to know for the money, my friend. So these are the things that I have to learn right now. I'm going to learn it. I feel like you should too. So when I say things like choppy line, I don't necessarily mean tele- telemarketing or nothing nefarious or anything else to do with you know, criminality literally could be a plan you have set in place right now. That and while this, just imagine now you're in, you're in, a, you're in the house of solitude, you're in your chamber for work, 
for build yourself, for grow yourself, now is the time for actually get that plan together of building the dream body where you want. Of actually building the dream mindset where you want. To see the dream house where you want so you can build it. To see the future so you can be in it. You see me like, I just fact so. I'm telling you the truth. The staying healthy part for me too. Actually, I was more, I'm being motivated by mainly my peers to exercise more than anything. We got man like Rasai, like Kenny. And we see all them all work out. We got man like Jackal, them man they work out every morning. So it forced me, you know, if I say, all right, if more, come on, what's the deal? I forgot to do it. No. If I want to perform well on stage, I'm a craft when this thing done, if I want to be the best, no. I don't want to be on the roadside, no. So my money, I have, to, I have to think about it. So for me right now, nothing no more important than them treating you like. No bickering, no fighting, no system. No, nothing. There is no a personal battle being taken place by everybody. While there's a global issue happening, there's a personal battle taking place with everybody right now. You know, you have to face your head yourself head on. Things that we never want to face before. You don't have them bag of parties that for distract you. And them bag of friend around you and a bag of Ray and a bag of Tay and a bag of that. No, you really just have yourself. And this personal battle where you fight. You have to just do it. You have to just go take it up. You have to just go take it serious. You see me? You have to just take it serious. Like, take yourself serious. Like, take your health very serious. Like, you know what I mean? Everybody keeps saying underlying issues, underlying issues. Do you know what underlying issues mean? That means while you feel physically well, like you see it, your skin looking good, everything, something could be happening in the un- underlying that when these viruses attack you, they just cause more issues than they should and lead to death. So what we need to do is make sure so we environment inside of we balance. You know what I mean? Like the environment inside of us is an environment too. You know what I mean? More water. You have 70% water. How could you be eating more food than drinking water? That's the first issue. That's the first issue. You're not drinking enough water. May I tell you that straight. Because you're supposed to drink one gallon of water every day. If you not drink that, then you're already behind time. You see me? So you have to just drink water straight. That that alone will improve enough on the life. Whole heap of soda, whole heap of bag juice, whole heap of thing and Pepsi and whole heap of nasty, whole heap of things, bro. Whole heap of things where you don't know moderate either. So on the environment, I forget up. Get out some of the acid, my friend. Get out some of the mucus. You see, man, he's not no elk guru, but man, I tell you, I haven't been sick in like 10 years. Like, no flu, no chick V, no, none of that shit. Straight. I'm a nah, go all day, none of I still eat fish, I still a snack, and women, I still eat Doritos and them fuck that I should not eat. But the amount of water with me drink, the amount of tea with me drink, the amount of bush tea with me drink. I make sure I have moderation. You know, I see me get up every day and I eat fish, 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 fish. It's snack, 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 snack. But, but for all one week, I just some Irish mash. Straight. I just drink that every day. No food. So, you have to clean up the inside. Then the next meditation too is, the found never ever fucking sit down and meds a book yet. When you naturally, even someone might naturally have some knowledge, when I wonder, I only get it from... Yeah, man, it naturally, you know, you for have the knowledge in general, but you need to go study more, get your meds, level off, change up the thing the way I think, bro. So if you used to think, bro, but I know that's foolishness. That's fuck you. Like what this celebrity was up to or that celebrity or you dare think, bro, you know, just things where you should not think, bro. No, it's the time to get your mind to think, bro. Some things where if you think, bro, like, Every day I get up, I think about one thing. I want to be the best artist in the world. I want to be the best artist in Jamaica, in the Caribbean, in the world. Every day I get up to that. Every day. And I just try to put things in place to get me there. Do I know what I'm doing? I don't know. But as long as we keep saying that, I just see things are falling into place. So at least get it there. Isn't it? So, and then the next thing is, not for when I ever research what money can do for you. You ever find out what your money can do for you? Like, for real, for real. Like, what can my money do for me? I say the thing I ask for myself, and I don't feel like I have everything well together. And may I say this to you because I eat my depot one too. Like, what can my money do for me? How do I make it stay a little longer? How do I make it work for me? These are the things you have to find out. 
Because, especially for the Jamaican youth, they the ghetto, the most things them can see is the, is, is the negative things to the world, of course, and to the system. But to them, that's a way out. And I just want them mindset open up and broaden because me too could have easily pick any of them choices there. I see the same world me I come from. But I feel like I just did always a balance with my meds. So I drink enough water, bro. From time. Not even just now, from then till now. Yeah, bro. So that's staying healthy and keeping your mind right. Especially now, especially for the Jamaican them way. Me never you the curfew thing never ever affect me. Me never really care. Me never give a fuck. Like me never nobody can tell me what to do. Like I'm going to music for that reason. Nobody can tell me when to come out for the road. There it is the laws and the fullness thereof. Nobody can tell me what to do with myself. You know, with my time, with my energy, where to go, what to do, what to say. So me never care about the curfew. But it's when the curfew do good eleven and the show them I come back, my friend. And you see the money start come back a little more where you know you can't feed your family, you can't take care of your, 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 your bills and everything. You're like, all right, I can't deal with this. Then just go right back to 7 p.m. It really, it threw me off. It threw me off. Like, militarily did a priest. So, all right, so I guess I'm going to stop the music. Because them pussy and I make me get kicked out of my house because I can't, you know, express my talent and stuff like that. And at the same time, I have people in the medical field where I say, the place kind of, I tell hospital them full, for real. Like I don't know, I'm not, I haven't been there myself, but I've been hearing that from people I don't think would lie to me. So it just puts me in a weird position. So I start thinking, well, yo, maybe farming, yo, maybe this is maybe this is as far as the road can go. You see me? But then today, I just come out of a series of meetings, finding out say I am the bag. Like you see me? Like shit I'm doing is making an impact in places that I've never been. I've never seen these impressions. It's crazy for somebody with less than 50,000 followers across every platform. Like, marriage millions of people, like, every month. So it's like, after them calling, I start realizing now, so damn, maybe I wasn't looking at myself as an income stream, as I thought, like, every aspect of me. You see me? So, that's what I'm really forward live when I say, yo, a time for a focus on some income streams. Different income streams, income streams that nobody can come and lock me up feet because them set some rules, say them me can do it, but them can do it. Cause we know said scamming are going all over the place, insurance, everything, all these things, but it ain't a history. But them you take can do it. So alright, cool, we can do it. Alright, cool. Alright, alright, don't ban it for we and make it easy for yourself. You know, no ban weed from me for years. We couldn't sell weed, no weed I sell the man we ban people from weed I, I sell weed. That's crazy to me. So if every avenue they get locked down, you now we have to start look at ourselves as income streams, and do, you know, and just do different things, and focus as I said more really upon the mental part of things, the immune part of things like health, and making this money work for you. What, however little you have however little you have like just to make it work for you every story i've i've heard wasn't started from a billion dollars it was five dollars to ten dollars to a hundred dollars to a thousand dollars to ten thousand then to a hundred thousand then to a million then to a billion then, you know what i mean it's so it's like we have to find a way to make money work for it especially as youths so let me say me can respect a man when i have ambition in this gideon you really have to set a plan you have to like even in music, I'm not just shooting in the dark. I have a plan. Whether or not it'll work to the fullest of me, I think that plan should have be. That's left to be seen. But I work towards a plan and a goal. And, you know, unlike anybody else, I'm doing music full time. There's no, and I'm independent. So there's no, like, I'm not having this job and then doing this. I'm fully into my dream. And it's fully making me able to do that. Yes, but with all that's happening in the world, I'm basically just saying, we still need to find ways to make money work for us. We still need to find ways for us to work for us. Like yourself, we still have to find a way for you. Make you work for you. So therefore, you're gonna need to be healthy for that. As I said, everything keep boiling back down to these three things. Everything in this life, whether or not it's a pandemic or not, it's three things. Your health, and that's been a big thing from start of life till now. That's why there's a medical, there's the Ministry of Health. These things are etched in history like you need it. 
So your health is very important. Your mental health is very important. Very. And your financial health. 